students welcome to this video this is lecture number 27 already 26 lecture are covered the solve the supplementary problem of this book vector analysis by mr spiegel you all know that the physics honors of the mathematics honors is an important part of the vector analysis and we want to solve this supplementary problem because of this is also important for iit jam examination in this lecture or in this video we want to solve 4.0 8.0 to 4.84 of chapter 4 which consists gradient divergence and curl of this book so let's go to the first question 4.80 evaluate this so for that you know the i want to find out this separately that is gradient of 1 by r cube you know the formula is simply derivative of this this is minus r to the power 4 with r cap r cap means r vector by r so this can be written as minus 3 by r to the power 5 r vector so divergence of r into this uh, is nothing but the minus so minus 3 taken as the common so minus 3 by r to the power 5 into r vector so this will be nothing minus 3 divergence of uh, 1 by r to the power 4 1 by r to the power 4 into r vector so this is minus 3 and you know the formula this uh, identity formula that is grade phi dot a minus divergence of a minus now this is plus into phi okay so this can be written as the gradient of 1 by r to the power 4 dot r minus divergence of r into phi means 1 by r to the power 4 okay so this is minus 3 and this is nothing but minus 4 by r to the power 5 into r cap that is r vector by r dot r minus this is nothing but 3 you all know if you don't know then go through the previous lecture you can <laughs> get the divergence r is 3 so this is minus 3 and this is r square so you get minus r by uh, sorry this is plus minus r by 4 r to the power 4 plus 3 by r to the power 4 so you guess minus 1 by r to the power 4 so this is 3 by r to the power 4 is the answer of this question 3 by r to the power 4 is the answer of this question go to the next question evaluate this <laughs> this so at first i want to solve this 1 by r square into r cap okay so this is uh, used as this formula divergence of 1 by r square dot r plus divergence of r into 1 by r square okay so this is nothing but minus 2 by r cube into r cap r cap means r vector by r dot r vector and this is 3 by r square so this will be 3 r square so minus minus 2 by r square plus 3 by r square so we get this is 1 by r square so this can be equals to grad square this is the 1 by r square so what is the grad square grad square means divergence of grad 1 by r square what is 1 by r square 1 by r square minus 2 by r q into r cap that is r vector by r so this is nothing but divergence of minus 2 by r to the power 4 r vector right uh, uh, r to the power 4 by r vector so okay so minus 2 divergence of 1 by r to the power 4 into this so this can be written as gradient of 1 by r to the power 4 dot r plus 1 by r to the power 4 divergence of r okay so minus 2 is common so this will be minus 4 by r to the power 5 r cap that is r vector by r dot r and this is the 3 so 3 by r to the power 4 so this is minus 2 this is r square so this minus 4 by r to the power 4 plus 3 by r to the power 4 so this will be 1 by r to the power 4 so this is 
2 by r to the power 4 this is the answer of this question <coughs> go to the next question 4.82 if a vector equals to this so gradient of divergence a first divergence a is nothing but divergence of a so this is divergence of a means r 1 by r 1 by r r vector so this is gradient of 1 by r dot r vector plus divergence of r into 1 by r so this is nothing but minus 1 by r square r cap r cap means r vector by r dot r vector plus this is 3 by r this is r square so r square cancel out minus 1 by r plus 3 by r so this will be 2 by r now the gradient 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 of this 2 by r so grad means 2 by r so this is 2 and 1 by r's derivative by r square into r vector by r so this is nothing but minus 2 r cube r vector so this is the answer of this question go to the next question uh, for a proof grad square f of r equal to this so grad square f of r is nothing but divergence of gradient f of r the gradient f of r you know this is nothing but the simply derivative that is d of dr into 1 by r r cap means 1 by r r vector okay so divergence of this can be written as 1 by r df dr dot r vector plus divergence of r into df dr into 1 by r so this is if we derivative this minus 1 by r square df dr plus 1 by r 1 by r d2f dr square into r cap that is r vector by r dot r vector and this is the 3 by r df dr okay and you can uh, you can write as this r vector by r equal r square by r so there is a r so if we this is r df by dr and this is d2f dr square and this is 3 by r df by dr so you can write d2f dr square plus 2 by r df dr hence proved okay go to the next question uh, b this is says that grad square f of r is 0 that's mean this part can be written as 0 so b says grad square f of r is 0 the grad square f of r can be written as d2f dr square plus 2 by r df dr will be 0 is this okay 2 by r df dr okay is to 0 we need to find out the solution of f of r so this can be written as so this can be written as this is nothing but ddr of df dr plus 2 by r so this is nothing but minus 2 by r df dr so d of df dr by df dr is equals to minus 2 dr by r so this is nothing but ln df by dr is equals to minus 2 ln r some constant this is taken as ln c so df dr is nothing but c r to the power minus 2 that means c by r square so <coughs> f uh, df is equals to c by r square dr if again integrate so f equals to minus uh, sorry 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 c uh, r to the power minus 2 plus 1 by 
minus 2 plus 1 plus another constant d so f of r is nothing but minus c by r plus d this is the solution of this question minus c by r plus d is the solution okay go to the next question prove that this vector is solenoidal you know any vector is solenoidal if their divergence is zero if this is zero then we can say a is soli solenoidal a is b solenoidal so now we need to find out the divergence of a divergence of a is nothing but del del x of the coefficient of x this is 3y square sorry 3y to the power 4 z square plus del del y of coefficient of y cap this is 4x q z square plus del del z of coefficient of k cap minus 3 x square y square so there is no x this is 0 there is no y this is 0 there is no z this is also 0 since this is 0 so we can say so a is surely no dull okay this is very simple good so that's all uh, this is all about me and this is my contact details you can contact with me by whatsapp or telegram for any query regarding physics and this is my details of the youtube channel you can go through this youtube channel you can get all this video and subscribe this channel if you new in this channel and press the bell icon to get that <laughs> instant information when i upload this video and share this video to your friends so that they can also beneficial with this video thank you take care we will meet in the next video as soon as possible